Hey folks, welcome to my YouTube channel. And this is a channel about my life in Canada, about workout and about health. And today I'm just going to share with you my real uh, training routine and I'm gonna train chest, my chest. And actually, I'm a natural athlete. This is my way and this is my choice. This video, I'm gonna start some line of episodes when I'm going to share with you all my training routine I want to tell you about how I'm training to stay healthy, to stay in a good body shape. I'm 35 years old and maybe for you it uh, should be pretty interesting how, how I'm staying in uh, this body shape every time. Uh, like, you know, whole year I'm staying in, in the same shape and I want to share how I'm doing this, okay guys? A couple of years ago uh, I weighed around 67, 67 kilo. And for now, my average weight is around 80 kilo or maybe 85, 83 kilo. So yeah, this is my annual body shape. So yeah, long story short, let's talk about uh, this uh, training routine about my chest workout. I'm trying to keep this training as, as simple as possible. And why I'm doing this? Because I'm training in a natural way. If you ask me train in a natural way, you should keep your training routine as simple as possible. Don't put a lot of exercise in one training routine because your body is not going to handle it. And it's uh, sometimes you can find like extremely huge volume on in some kind of exercise in another athlete on YouTube channels. But I, I, could, I should say you guys, maybe you don't need to do this exactly the same way if you are natural athlete. And it's uh, the main reason why your body is not going to handle a lot of exercise putting in one particular training routine. So yeah, it's going to, I'm going to make some dips and then um, I'm going to train my chest in second exercise. So, so you will see how I'm doing this. Just pay attention guys, how I'm doing this, which angle I'm using. All this information is pretty important and just take a look. I'm, I will try to explain, but I'm not going to make this video extremely long. So yeah, it's, as I said, it's like some line of episodes and you will find another information in playlist about chest training, which I'm going to create in the nearest future. So yeah, guys, stay tuned and let's come up. I just got amazing gym in my condo, you can see, you can see, once I will show around here, I think, in some another walk. So yeah guys, uh, between the sets, I'm just trying to get as much as possible some steps, yeah. And today I got some rain outside, so I did enable to walk around a lot, so I'm for gainer as I said. I'm not trying to do any cardio at the same day when my workout day and I, I would advise you to do the same and I'm trying to get at least 8,000 uh, 8, uh, steps per day it's uh, my uh, everyday goal just between the sets uh, my break around 2 minutes or even 3 minutes and this is science based approach so yeah, let's get back to my dips. Baby, this is do or die. Feel it in my veins tonight. Emotional suicide. 
You know it's an eye for eye I'm training my chest with uh, biceps and today I'm not going to train my biceps because um, I'm going to train like only chest and you'll see like for the first first exercise of dips, second exercise of bench press and then at the end of this video you'll find some bonus from me uh, I'll get I'll give you some tips how to keep your shoulders as healthy as possible and I will show you some exercise for this and it should be extremely useful for you. I would advise you to do this maybe like every two days and your shoulders will be healthy all time. Because as we do in all dips, it's extremely harmful exercise for your shoulder and you can get you can get so many problems with your shoulder if, shoulders if you not doing this exercise in a proper way. Me friends, due to I'm, I'm a hard gainer and I'm pretty tall, um, like 125 centimeters and around 80 kilo, and my hands is pretty pretty long, and that's why for me extremely hard to build my chest. Uh, that's why I'm doing dips, and this is exercise my main exercise to build on my chest, and you, you can see the result. And yeah, guys, I'm trying to do at least nine exercises for my chest in one workout day, in one workout routine. So yeah, friends, we'll do some final set for my chest, for my dips. And this is the final one. This, the weight now is around 70 leaps, and it's pretty hard because my my personal weight is 80 kilo, and you can imagine how hard it should be for you.
chosen one. I'm not the one to underestimate. I want the throne alone to crush obstruction, rush the bed case, levitate. Got it tatted on me, told them follow me. They see the vision now. It's 2020, clear as tile, legs as clear as day. No longer move around in fear, disarray. Pray you hear me like the winter wind against your window pane. Feel the bass, baby, soak it in and let it marinate. It's time to hustle, gotta muscle up and run through bed case. Yeah. So yeah, friends, I'm, I'm going to finish uh, this walk, this uh, training routine here, this chest workout, and right, right now I'm trying to focus on to build my chest because, as I said, I'm a tall Hargainer, so that's why for me it's pretty hard to build chest, and it's pretty important to have a huge chest as well, of course, as your back. So yeah, um, pay attention to some info uh, which I'm going to put inside of this video, and I will leave some useful information under this video in comment section below as well as on description, description section so yeah guys i hope you enjoyed this my real training routine for natural bodybuilders and i will try to catch you in the next one give me a thumbs up if you like it and subscribe to my channel guys i'm going to make a lot of video about this uh, about my training routine and yeah guys you can all peace out Now it's 2020, clear as tile, legs as clear as day. No longer move around and.